Hello, welcome to today's video. I'm Joseph, also known as the Dragon Whisperer. Today we're going to be doing some more Minecraft um, in the ASMR gaming style. As you can see, I'm joined by Ashley right at the beginning as the Pink Ranger. She's stealing all the jungle wood that I am currently dropping from my tree. That was me kind of yelling at her for it. Not yelling. Me being upset. I was like, hey, that was my jungle wood. You didn't need to take my jungle wood. Apparently she disagreed, but that's her opinion, right? So, um, before we get really down to the nitty gritty of the video, as always, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the video, share the channel, you know, this helps spread the word, and if you'd like to more directly support the channel, the Patreon link is, as always, in the description below. Alright, so, today was another day of, apparently staring at the side of her head, uh, cutting, chopping wood, cutting down trees collecting lumber and stuff like that. There's a cow. Um, yeah. Oh. And if you don't like specifically like the look of acacia, oak, or birch, even dark oak, I highly recommend doing the four sapling um, growth method for spruce trees and for jungle trees because you get a stack and almost almost two stacks of the jungle and I think about a stack and a half of the spruce for every tree you cut down it, you can't go wrong with that and on top of that you get a ton of spruce or not just spruce you get a ton of saplings back too from it Which, anyone who knows anything about jungle trees knows that that doesn't usually happen. Jungle trees, I have found, were the worst for um, yielding saplings unless you build it, or you uh, plant one of the large trees. Like I've had situations where I've planted, I want to say, 42 uh, regular jungle trees and I got four saplings back so then I planted those four saplings as a large tree and I got like 25 so you know not even if you want to collect a ton of saplings if you want to get like break even get the saplings that you um planted back that's the best way to go in my honest opinion I mean that's just my opinion right you don't have to go for it or anything like that oh, I think if I'm correct what I'm about to do is build one of my automatic which have become extremely widely widely popular uh, from what I've seen. Yep. <clears throat> Here I go. So you place your output chest at the bottom. You put a hopper on top of that. And then you put a furnace on top of the hopper. Here's where it gets tricky. You have to crouch for this. You put a hopper onto the side, hopper on the top, and your chest on the side hopper is going to be your fuel. It feeds it directly into the fuel slot on the uh, 
furnace. And then your top one is whatever you want to feed into it. So in this case, I'm pretty sure I'm grabbing some logs. I was asking Ashley what logs she's uh, not going to use. I'm pretty sure she, sure she said jungle wood or birch, I don't remember. Gotta grab some more fuel. All right, I wasn't making charcoal. I was making stone. I'm full. I didn't realize I was full until the third time I tried putting an item in. The best part about these furnaces, you know, as as with all furnaces, you have to be in the area for them to work. But the best part, ah, there we go. Grab some jungle logs. Is that the furnace will will feed the fuel and the the uh, materials you're smelting. It's smelting. I'm not sure how that came out the first time, but they'll feed them directly into the furnace for you using the hopper. <clears throat> um, those who have tuned into my live streams have seen like I've got. So in some t in some cases, I've got entire rooms just full of them, you know. And as you can see from that sudden uh, brightness there, the logs went directly into the furnace. It's filling right now. Boom! There's my charcoal output complete. And the chest will keep emptying into it, like into the hopper, until all four slots are full. Which is also really good. And like, let's say, let's say you've got some logs going on in the hopper, uh, the hopper, and you're um, cooking stone or iron <coughs> in the furnace. The hopper's got one stone or one iron, and then a bunch of. Uh, <coughs> And then a bunch of, um, the logs. And you, you know, you want, you want to keep, uh, smelting the iron, for example. Once you put the iron into the chest, it'll automatically put the iron into the hopper, as long as you got one in that hopper. And the iron will empty into the furnace first. So it'll always prioritize whatever it is you've got going on in there right now. Here I go with my clear cutting. Ah yes, collecting clay. Clay is quite a versatile um, material to work with. <clears throat> uh, with clay you can do stuff like, you can just cook the clay directly and make bricks. You can uh, put the clay back into blocks, cook it, make it terracotta. Hmm. I'm trying to think. I know there's more use for clay. Pretty sure there's more use for clay. I think it, if you have 
a note block it does something, but I'm not sure. Either way. standing there because I'm eating something or I'm standing there because I'm waiting for the tree to deteriorate above me. I'm not 100% sure. <clears throat> or I might just be doing something else in general. I don't know, it really depends on when the video was recorded. Either way, I'm going to be making this an official announcement uh, in tomorrow's video, which will be the first of the month video, which I haven't 100% decided yet if it's going to be a live stream or not. At the point of recording this, at the point that this video is up, I'm pretty sure it's going to be a live video because it's a Saturday night and I'll be able to do a live stream. Yay! Hopefully. Hmm. <clears throat> but anyway, uh, you may have noticed that last week I uploaded a Minecraft video on Friday, and this week I'm uploading I uploaded a video on Friday. Uh, it's because I plan to make Minecraft the second video of each week. So I'm still gonna have the regular Tuesday video. But I'm going to have Minecraft come out on Friday. Yay! Um, I might also be doing some other ASMR gaming stuff. Um, eventually. Like, I want to get a... Um, <clears throat> I, need a I need to get a new capture card, as I've said before. Um, then, do s I can do stuff like this. Or I can even do it like I did with the um, Final Fantasy Tactics and do the voice recording at the same time as playing. Of course that will depend on the game and the capture card I guess. I don't see it being a major issue but not 100% sure. Alright, now we're both... Oh, no. Nope, now, now Ashley's just standing there. I'm moving around. So that's good, at least. I guess. It's always better for somebody to be moving. Otherwise, the video is just a picture. Did I just see a hole? I think I made that hole. I made that hole when I was digging for clay, I'm pretty sure. Anyway. Back, adult, back on track. Um, oh, now I stopped moving, now Ashley's moving. It's a possibility I went to pick up one of the kids from dance, and Ashley was just moving me to collect the stuff. <clears throat> Which would make sense. Hmm. Well, Ashley's doing her own chopping. I apologize for the car outside. Apparently we're a racing street. At least to that one guy. But we're not much of a racing street. We are a bend street. There shouldn't be anyone driving that fast down here. But you're never going to stop people, right? I'm sorry if I sound weird right now. I'm, I'm still trying to get used to the whole voicing over thing. I'm not 
100% sure. I don't know. <clears throat> As it stands right now, like not being on camera, I kind of feel awkward doing it. But I'm sure that I'll pass once I've done enough voicing over. We're standing still again. Sorry about this. Ashley must have had some kind of emergency that she's got dark oak just floating in front of her. sure how long we're standing still. Okay. Um, so you'll notice a jump there. I cut a lot of the standing still time out. Because I don't feel that us standing there is really doing the job, as it were. But at the same time, I don't know, standing there, kind of relaxing, relaxing, there we go. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm definitely thinking I'm going to get a kid from dance at this point, just based completely off of the fact that I'm still not moving, um, and Ashley's gathering her own dark oak. Which, you know, as you've seen from the videos so far, is a rare thing. Chopping some trees, chopping some trees, standing there staring at the sand and a sheep. Sorry, I got distracted <laughs> during my voiceover. So, actually chopping some more trees down. Just leaving all the wood just sitting on the floor there. It's a 
ground there. I wonder if we're going to play it again today. Who knows? Most likely. There's been a lot of stuff happening in uh, the game recently. It's not so much just uh, chopping down trees for me. Um, Ashley has come quite f uh, quite a long way with the house. Actually, died a couple times that I really don't agree with. I mean, the one. The one I don't agree with because it was just so much. Like it, it shouldn't have happened. Second one. I don't. It was one of those. All the stuff I've been through and then that. But. You know, you'll see that when it comes. To, at the time, right now, we're chopping trees. Well, actually, chopping trees. Based on the length of the video, I'm very much sure I went to pick up a kid. Yep. There's also going to be a couple videos when I'm not moving at all, because Ashley decided she was going to play without me. They hurt my feelings. There's a cat purring in the hallway. Yeah, I'm still standing there looking at the sand. Enjoy the sounds of the trees as Ashley chop, chop, chops them.
Ashley stop moving again. Why did you stop moving, Ashley? You're not getting the kids I am. Ashley's still working on the second floor of the house, as you can see. Which is very much different. In this situation, because... Well, not different per se. Oh, she's still working on the first floor. Oh, she's still on the first floor. Oh, wow. This video really is older. Sorry, the sound of blocks being placed is super relaxing to me.
I'm back and I'm swimming. I've got a kid from dance. It's go time. Now Ashley stop moving again. Good times. All right, now we're both moving. We're both collecting trees. We're collecting different trees. I'm pretty sure I was collecting this birch to just fill up the chest or make charcoal. Either way, I also cleared up that uh, whole waterfront doing this, which really helped. A lot of the trees I've cut down were just chopping down to make space. Bad as it sounds. I was hunting the trees for the sake of hunting the trees. Food. I was hunting them for sport. Which I guess was. Waha. Frown upon in some societies. But, you know what? If I want to hunt this tree for sport, I will hunt the tree for sport. tree for food. I will hunt the tree for food.
house on this wall. She almost jumped right off. But who does that? Nobody jumps off the walls, right? You fall off the walls. Kind of the birch trees really opened up the shoreline too though. I mean look at that. That was all birch trees as far as the eye could see. Now it's not. Now it's dirt and grass and sand. Definitely cutting down trees. I stop moving again. There's a reason behind this. I'm thinking I might have been getting ready to go to sleep. Or actually stop moving too, so something happened. Oh well. Oh well indeed. People starting to get up in the house. It's, it's uh, it's my day off, so I decided I was going to do the voiceover before anyone woke up, and apparently I failed to do so. As long as I don't make too much noise, it should be fine. There's a cat, cat meowing out there now because somebody got up and closed the door to the bathroom 
and now they're going to make all sorts of noise and I apologize for it. started the audio skipped a little bit ahead in the um, video so we're back on track actually still chopping down houses and trees and building and all sorts of things so that's fun I'm still not moving. Alright, I looked ahead. I didn't move for the rest of the video. So I definitely, most likely went to bed or something. So, carry on, Ashley, making all your stuffness. One of the things I've always felt that Minecraft should, um, introduce is the ability to carry a torch in your left hand so you've got a light source personally you know what I mean because like I feel that it would help in a lot of situations to just be able to
carry that torch? Rather than keep placing the torch and you know, look at that torch didn't place properly or oh I've gone three feet and that torch no longer lights up the area. You know, stuff like that. And I don't think I'm the only person who feels that way. Personally. <clears throat> Uh, the other game I had spoken about, I don't think they did it either, but now that I'm thinking about it, the game Terraria allows you to carry a torch and it lights up the area. They've even got like glowstone, glow, or glow sticks, so that you can use them underwater and stuff. It's terribly convenient. It really is. getting within the last 20 minutes of the video. And Ashley's begun digging up dirt. There's a reason behind it, if I'm correct. If she's doing what I think she's doing, she's not just filling in where she took sand from. Oh, looks like you don't get to see her next building project until next video. Or maybe the video after that. Or even the one after that. That having been said, our next project is another ambitious one that requires me to chop a lot of wood. Oh, she's running towards me now. That's kind of weird. She ran past me now. And she just noticed the hole there. That's pretty rough. saying she just noticed this hole here I think she went down I think she just wanted the iron to be honest she it actually has got this habit of she'll have something on her mind and she'll walk past something in Minecraft and completely forget about it because she wants the thing she just walked past Which is fairly normal, to be honest. <clears throat> like, it's not exactly like... It's a, it's a rare thing to do. After all, Minecraft is mostly... Gathering materials, right? So... Sorry about background noise if it's coming up. Ashley's up and she's watching something on her phone. Don't mind her. Don't mind her. Alright, 
Alright, so we're getting in the last 15 minutes of the video. So now it's it's getting down to the nitty gritty watch the furnace burn things point. Particularly for Ashley. I'm just watching grass grow, apparently, so that's me. Troops, I should right now. Sorry, I'm uh, reading something right now. the front door that Ashley is planning right now. We're going to play a game, okay? Alright, so here goes. The game is... How many times is Ashley going to move the stairs that she builds until she finally decides that she likes where it is? As it stands right now, she's moved them, I want to say at least four times. She has a tendency to move the stairs several times until she decides where she wants them. Right now she's planning. You can see the planning in her mind. Well, not her mind. You can see the planning in the floor. This is brown sheep. I'm pretty sure right now she's trying to decide if she's going to expand out. Which is another thing she has a tendency to do. planning all sorts of things right now. <laughs> Alrighty. I think she's got an idea. Wait a minute. I know what she's doing right now. Right now she's trying to plan walls. She's trying to decide if she wanted to keep the dark oak wall or if she wanted to do a different wall for the interior. She likes to look a dark oak on the outside, but on the inside it seems like it's too dark. Oh, okay. She thought of something. She's got an idea. going to involve more ideas, <laughs> more thinking. There she goes. All right. What's she going to do? I think this is a window she's building.
which is another thing that she has changed her mind on so many times. It's actually ridiculous how many times she's changed her mind on the windows. Anyway, so we're in the last 10 minutes of the video. So there's going to be a little bit more going on. Not too much. Still a lot of uh, background noise. I'm not sure if you guys are picking it up, but I am. Um, I'm hoping because the microphone is faced in a different direction. You're not picking it up? <sighs> Sorry, I yawned. I'm tired. I've actually got, um... Actually working on it. To get, get all that, like, why I'm tired. All the time figured out. I've got, I've got another appointment. So that's that's good. I'm, I'm at least working towards getting a result. standing still again. I'm sure she'll start moving again. Yep, there she goes. getting down to this point if there are other videos you'd like to see feel free to comment them below if there are other games you'd like to see played I uh, comment those below as well and if I uh, do in fact have them I will see what I can do about making doing it with um, Stardew Valley, maybe Terraria, maybe not Terraria. Terraria has a tendency to get very intense, I guess. I guess, I guess intense is the word I'm going to use. But Stardew stays a nice calm game too. Like you, you go even even when you get to the combat stuff, it's super mellow. It doesn't look like I'm picking anything up. So 
that's good at least. Hmm. Um, so yeah, so any other videos you'd like to see made or other games you'd like to see played, that's fun. Also, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the video, and um, feel free if you'd like to directly support the, the channel to go to the Patreon link, which is in the description below, and become a patron. We have memberships as low as $1 a month which is less than a cup of coffee and it's super manageable <clears throat> we got a lot of dirt right now it's funny because we end up with like these very I think we've got less than a stack of dirt right now in our uh, like in the game also going to get a lot more sand so we've got a lot more glass all right I'm warning you ahead of time she's gonna tear down these windows if she hasn't yet she's going to Sorry, again, I like the sound of the blocks being placed. Alright, so, the first of the month video, um, if I found live, sh live streaming, which like I said, I am not sure at the time of the recording and it's like a week from now um, I'll probably be live streaming sometime towards the evening with my January updates and um, if not the video will be going up probably around the same time on Saturday you know uh, probably around 7 I can do it even later on Saturday, now that I'm thinking about it, because it is a Saturday. Yes. That's excellent. Hmm. Alright. We're in the last couple, minute, couple minutes of the video. So, I think I'm going to do a couple shoutouts too. Um, I'd like to do one shoutout right now to Frank. Frank is the first Patreon, patron to the page. Um been loyal um, he has requested a video that like I keep saying I am working on I'm doing the research for it I want it to be a really good video for him for you if you're watching um, I want it to be a real good video for all of you too not just not, not just Frank but I want you all to enjoy it uh, another shout out uh, light in the darkness ASMR haven't heard from her in a while on on the channel but um, she do, she does produce good videos so go check her out and if you're looking to laugh go check out two real productions it's two T W O Real R E E L Productions. Productions. Two real productions. Uh, it's mostly animated videos. Um, did a collaboration with me for E3 last year, which I'm still proud of because all of pretty much every production I came up with came true. But anyway, alright, so we're at the end of the video. 
So I'm going to do my usual spiel. Up in the top left corner, you should be seeing the um, subscribe button for the channel. Top right corner will be the newest video on the channel. Bottom left will be a video best suited for you. Bottom right is going to be the Minecraft playlist. So, as always, have a peaceful day. Bye.